That was a classic bean crayon last year. I think it was pretty good. Alright, it's a suit, and then like it's a blow up horse, and you're standing in it, and it looks like you're sitting on the horse. <laughs> probably, I don't know, Joseph was Wayne Gretzky one year. It's probably the best I've ever done. Uh, when I dressed up as a goalie, probably. I was a B one time when I was a little guy, so that would be the best one. Probably dressing up as a blind referee. Uh, I was Otto for, from Rocket Power. I'd probably have to go with uh, Woody from Toy Story. <laughs> I've heard I look like him, and I think that's a, uh, that's a good costume for me. Um, I don't know. There's been a, there's been a lot, so I can't point out one. But for Alec, I think he does <laughs> he does look like uh, Woody from Toy Story, so that'd be good. Just a, I was wearing a wig. And I, yeah, just being lazy yeah. with a mask. Not a lot of effort there. I tried being Batman one year. It was just awful. I dressed up as an orange M&M. And I looked really fat. I dressed up as uh, Santa Claus one year, and that was a very hot costume to be walking around in. Well, like wearing, like not dressing up for Halloween would probably be my, my worst uh, Halloween costume. Luke Skywalker. Probably Woody from Toy Story. Yeah, I'd have to go with the uh, the Viking, or no, the cowboy hat Brandon wore last year. <laughs> um, that was it, actually. That was the whole costume. He wore a cowboy hat and uh, looked, looked uh, pretty horrific, so. Brought a green more suit down, so just a green man. I'm not sure what I'm gonna be this year. I haven't really thought about it. I'm getting a, a baby face this year. It looks like Ram Pitlick, so that's gonna go well. A goalie. I don't know, I might dress up as Harry Potter this year. I'll probably be a Woody from Toy Story. <laughs> <laughs> not to see, but not that's, every that's probably year. a go-to. I haven't um, made my decision yet, but I'm sure I'll have a good one. A king size uh, Kit Kat. Yeah, I'm a big fan of the king size ones, but I think I've gotten a few dollars sometimes. So people just run out of candy. <laughs> yeah, you run out of candy. What else they gonna give? Big like, bag full of candy. Like the people just left the bucket out on the porch, and I just put the whole thing in my in my pillowcase and just walked away. So that was probably the best. Big king size Hershey bar. Two big uh, Hershey uh, cookies and cream candy bars. I guess candy or money, I don't know. Sometimes they forgot to have candy in Sweden. We don't like celebrate it so much as you guys, so when they forgot, you get money instead of candy, so that's probably the best. Money. Uh, toothbrush. I know I'm not a big fan of the treats, but um, that's all Halloween is pretty much, so. <laughs> I don't know a chocolate bar. For me, it, um, I think, I think I got some, some scotch tape one time. Um, <laughs> they ran out of candy, so they just I said, "All right, that'll do." Just like a little like Jolly Rancher, or Starburst. Yeah, or something. dumb dumb lollipops. Not a fan. Uh, some lady gave me like a, a health bar or something like that. Like, who wants a health bar on Halloween? Candy with the package already open. Probably crackers, peppermints, nothing. Uh, an apple, pencil. I've been tricked a couple times. There's too too many from a couple of my neighbors uh, too many times to remember, but. I'm gonna say a can of pop, or a can of soda, I guess you guys call it. <laughs> but um, just, I know, when it's, in, when it's in your trick or treat bag or whatever, it might break open. I know that's happened to me a few times, and all the candy gets kind of sticky, and 